All right, so welcome back to part two of The Hare and the Tortoise. Now, for those of you who were paying close attention to the last video, you might have noticed at the end of the round, at the end of the video, I only had seven cards out, and then the race began. Do you know why that is? Because of the second clarification of a beginning of a race. So the first, first clarification to note, that is... Once you have a maximum of eight out, it's the beginning of a race. Now, the only other way to end it and make it so you go into the race is when you get four of the same animal put out. And so that's what happened. Four wolves were put out and there were three other animals out. So once that fourth wolf was put out, it didn't matter. It did not matter who... Um, did not matter that there were only three other animals out because the beginning of the race had just started because of that because there were four of the same animal out so that's just just in case you guys thought maybe perhaps i played it wrong or something no i'm pretty sure i got that one right okay so now it's my turn for this round because so hand over the first player token ridley thank you all right so, let's see, what do I have for this round? I finally got a wolf, and I've got two of them, but I need more. I think I should definitely get myself more. So I think for now, we will play the hare. Just the hare. Alright, so that's it for me. Now it's Manta's turn. So what does Manta have? Oh, he's got two lambs. He's going to play two lambs for his turn. So now we've got three animals out. Okay, so now it's Ridley's turn. Hmm. Looks like he's going with the fox this time. Yep, looks like he's going with the fox. All right, so now that's four animals. So now it's back to me. So what should I play? I guess I'll play a fox. Yes, we'll play the fox. All right, so now we have five animals. We still need three more. Now it's Manta's turn. Hmm, looks like he is going to play one of the wolf cards this time. So now that's a total of three, five, and six. Now there's six out. Okay, so now it's Ridley's turn. Hmm. Looks like Ridley's going to go with... Yep, yeah, looks like Ridley's going to go with the wolf as well. So there's the wolf. And now we have a total of seven animals, so we still need that one more animal. Which doesn't really work for me, because I want to hold on to my wolves. So I guess we'll play a tortoise. It won't really matter too much, but we'll play the tortoise. Okay. So now we have our eight animals out, and so now the race will begin. Okay, now normally the hare would move two spaces. But you see, the hare is in first place. So because he's in first place, he is taking a nap. So he's not moving, he's not going anywhere this round. <laughs> okay, now it's the sheep's turn. So the sheep will get to move two. So now we'll move the sheep up two. Oh, there's water here. You know what that means? The sheep is going to be drinking some water. So only I got to move one this time because of the river. He's, he's going to quench his thirst. Now the fox. He'll get to move two. Two spaces. He's crafty, isn't he? Now he's in the lead. Nice job. And now it's the wolf's turn. Oh, sorry. I played this in wrong order. Let's see here. Technically, the wolf should be after the tortoise. And then, etc., etc. But... I guess it really doesn't matter right now. It'll matter at the end of the game when we're all getting close to the end, for sure. So I'll have to make sure to remember that when we get to the end, that it has to be done in order. Because you know, <laughs> it just does. So, um, okay, so the wolf, he gets to move one space because there's only two cards out. So he gets to just move here. And then the tortoise will move one regardless. So, all right. So now it's the wolf, the uh, fox who's in the lead. I told you the fox is crafty. He hasn't really stopped at all. He just keeps on a going. 
So you guys think it's going to be the Fox who's going to win this round? Maybe so. Who knows? Who knows? It could be anybody. Okay. So now that begins the next round. I'm going to need three more cards. Ridley's going to need two. And Manta's going to need three as well. So we'll do that. And then that. That. And that. 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 All right. And now Manta will get to go first this round. So let's see what Manta has. Well... Uh, he's got a hare. He's got the tortoise. Ooh, he's got four tortoises. Ooh, yes. He's going to play the four tortoises. Okay. That ends. That be actually not ends. That begins the race. Because once four animals have been played, it just begins the race. So, <laughs> so once again, the tortoise, he is going to get to move two spaces. So now the tortoise is in the lead. Isn't that awesome? The tortoise is winning. Woohoo! Yeah. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. You don't know who I'm voting for. It could be the fox. It could be the tortoise. It could be the hare. It could be the wolf. But it's definitely not the sheep. So, um, anyways, so that ends that round. And so now... Um, Ridley is going to go first, and obviously Manta, he needs four more cards, because he's the only one that went that round. Which is another cool thing to note. If you were to get, unless it was the wolf and the howl ability, obviously. But if you were able to get, like, four of the sheep out, or four of the foxes out, you know, or even four of the hares out, that those animals could move, all move, technically, but the tortoise could still move one regardless, even though he didn't get his, uh, which is awesome. That's that's a really cool strategy for the tortoise, um, that he would still get to move anyways. The only time he would not get to move is if the uh, wolf howled. And then that would make sense because he would withdraw into his shell because he was scared. So, anyways, so now it is Ridley's turn. So how is he going to play the turn? Oh, he's got three tortoises. Does he have four? He has four! He has he has four. He has four. So he's going to play all of them. Boom, boom. Sorry if they're upside down. Boom, boom. So he's got four played. So that begins the race once again. <laughs> wow. Four tortoises in a row again. See, he actually... But he didn't get them all at once. He had at least one or two, I think, he was holding on to for a while. So now the race begins. And the tortoise, he will move two spaces. Look at that. Look who's winning now. <laughs> All right. Now, I didn't tell you how this game will end. The game will end when the, the animal comes in third place. So when the first animal comes in first place, the game still continues. When the animal comes in second place, the game continues. When the animal comes in third place, the game is over. So, because you can score points for even third place. All right. So, now those will get discarded. Ridley will need four more cards. There we go. And now I'll get to go first this round. All right. Well, I don't have four of the wolves. I have three, but I don't have four. But you know what? We're going to go ahead and play all of them. All of my wolves. All right, for my turn. But that's only three, so that means it'll be Manta's turn now. So let's see what Manta's got for his turn. Ooh, he could add on to that, and I think he will. Maybe he's rooting for the wolf too. So now four wolves have been played, which means the race begins, which wouldn't really matter because, like I said, they would be putting cards down, and then no one would get to move except for the wolf anyways. So now the race will begin, and only the wolf is going to move, and he's going to get to move three spaces because there's four out. One, two, and three. Now look who's in second place. You guys all thought the wolf was going to lose, right? Well, look who's in second place now. 
<laughs> and everybody thought the fox was going to win, and now he's in third place. <laughs> and I feel sorry for anyone who was uh, betting on the sheep to win, because he's not doing so good. And obviously, the hare has been procrastinating, so he's probably not going to win either. Isn't that just the story of his life? Okay, well, I'm going to need four more cards now. Actually, I'm going to need three more, because I had three of those were mine. So... And he needs one more, too. Okay. Now it is back to Manta's turn. All right, so Manta, what do you have? What do you have? Well, he's got some foxes. He's got a lamb. Looks like he's going to play his foxes, though. He's playing all three of them. Boom, boom, boom. All right. That's his turn. Okay, so now it's Ridley's turn. Well, he's got some fox. He's got a fox. He's got a hare. He's got another hare. He's got the wolf. He's got the sheep. And the hare. Hmm. Well, he really wants that hare to, uh... Uh, maybe he's rooting for the hare, too. Who knows? So, looks like he's gonna play the hare. And, uh... Hold on. He's gonna play two of them. Because maybe he's trying to get that tortoise to win, and he doesn't have... Oh, he's going to play three of them. Sorry. He's going to play all three of them. So that way he can get more cards and hopefully some tortoises. Because maybe he's rooting for the tortoise. Which is obvious. Obvious, right? Okay, so... So that's six. So now it's my turn. So, let's see here. What should I play? Well, I have a lot of foxes. I don't know if I want to play them. We can play the hare. Yeah, let's play the hare. I'm going to play the hare. All right. And then that will end it regardless because four animals have been played. So, now everybody's going to move. That can move. So the hare goes first, obviously, and he gets to move two spaces regardless. So he'll go there. Then the tortoise will get to move one space because, after all, he always gets to move at least one, unless the uh, wolf does a howl. And then... Um, the wolf would go next, obviously, but he doesn't have any out, so he's not going anywhere. But the fox will be. He gets to move three spaces. One, two, and three. So now the wolf is in second place. And then the lamb would go last, but once again, <laughs> he has no cards out for him, so he isn't going anywhere. All right, now all these will get discarded, and we'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you for watching.